Right, hello, welcome back to NYC Friday. We are back in the kitchen. Um, we're having a bit of a cook off. Um, Ruth is here with me, and today we're going to be making pizzas. Yeah. Got a variety of uh, ingredients. Um, the oven is warm, so that's a bonus. I managed to turn that on. So uh, yeah, we're gonna make some pizzas, then we'll find out who's done it best. Maybe do a Mario impression halfway through with the dough. Uh, we'll see. So uh, yeah, let's crack on. Let's do it. Slap it bit. Slap the slap the slap the slap the slap the the slap the 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 Topping time, baby. Okay. Now, what are you going to do? We've got traditional tomato sauce, um, peppers, chorizo, pepperoni, mushrooms, pepperoni, cheese, yeah. chocolate spread, Oreos, Skittles. Yeah. Any choice? I think I'm going to go classic and go with tomato sauce and a bit of everything. Okay. So, you want a knife? For the peppers, yes. And the uh, roll the peppers. Yes. And I'm going to be doing a chocolate stuffed crust. I'm going to be doing a chocolate stuffed crust. I'm going to be doing a chocolate stuffed crust. I'm going to be doing a chocolate stuffed crust. I'm going to be doing a chocolate stuffed crust. I'm going to be doing a chocolate stuffed crust. I'm going to be doing a chocolate stuffed crust. I'm going to be doing a chocolate stuffed crust. Beautiful. 
They're in the oven. We'll be back in a moment once they're cooked. Right, pizzas are out. My chocolate one, I have to say, looks a little bit overcooked on the cheese, but other than that, it looks amazing. It's exactly how I thought it was gonna turn out. The skittles are really weird. They're gonna be yeah. bizarre, sweet, aren't they? Like, Ruth's uh, pepperoni meat feast mushroomy stuff looks amazing. I but I thought it was great. I think it's been made by the pepperoni. Oh, is that, is, is that what it is? That's what it is. So, only one way to find out, and that is find a knife. Ooh. That was a great sound coming out of the shing. So. Do you want to do this one first? Yeah, so, go for it. I mean. I yeah, would. yeah, sweet and savoury, savoury and sweet. Good crunch. I mean, it did stick a bit though, so I don't think it's going to be great underneath it, I don't know. I think maybe it was too thin. I mean, there's only one way to find out. Are you going to be offended by squares? No, no, I'm. Triangles. I'm okay with whatever. I mean, I should try and find some plates, maybe. It could get really hot and we could burn our mouths. All right, to get safety. Okay. Right, which bit are you having? I feel like this one looks like a good bit, doesn't it? But it is going to go everywhere, I fear. Ooh. Oh, it is squidgy in the middle. Hold it over. Mm. Like... But it's going to burn your mouth. It's going to burn your mouth. That bit of chorizo was really good. <laughs> well, the pepper on as well. I feel like it might be too hot to eat straight away. But, hey, you know what they say. It's all right. Mm. I have no complaints with what you've made. I mean, yes. The dough is a little bit thin and maybe raw in some places. <laughs> but other than that... Maybe it should be cooked a little bit longer. No, I mean, it looks decent. But it's all right. Yeah, I mean, that was really hot. <laughs> Just burnt the mouth. It's really hot. And there's like tomato and oil and everything Hmm. Right. Now with every meal, after that, you get dessert. So, let's see what happens when you put chocolate spread, cheese, Oreos and Skittles <laughs> on a pizza. Now, do you want a stuffed crust? Mm. Now, because mine's more... I was about to say, where's your stuffed crust? Here, because it's more square, or sorry, more round, you actually get a triangle. And the on the base as well. Hey, I told you, I worked in the pizza restaurant. So you were cheating for this challenge is what you're telling me? No, no. Now. It's gonna be so weird. I think you've got all the stuff. You ready? Yep. Oh, it's weird. That's amazing. Mm. That's good. Mm. The texture is strange because you have the chewy pickles mm -hmm. as well. You know when you get a deep pan pizza mm. and you take ages to chew it? Mm. It's like that because of Skittles, mm. not because of bread. But all in all, that is a taste sensation. It tastes good. Mm. Not meant by the texture. But I'd happily, like, I'm eating it very happily. And the stuffed crust. I'm glad they like. Mm. Well, all I'm going to say is, if we look at how much is left of each pizza, my dessert pizza is a winner winner chicken dinner. <laughs> Just because we cut it differently? Absolutely not. Anyway, let us know down below who you think won and. Uh, so, why do we bother doing this? Well, as we said at the beginning, you know, kneading that dough is hard work. It wasn't easy to make pizza dough by hand, even though we used a packet, we didn't weigh out ingredients and stuff like this. But actually, having a relationship with someone, having a relationship particularly with God, means you have to put in effort. 
it means you have to work hard at it. It means that it's not just all just going and playing sailing, but it takes time and effort. So this week, go and put some effort into getting to know who God is, getting to know the God who loves you so much that he sent his son to die on a cross for you and put some time and effort into that relationship. Um, but other than that, like, subscribe, do all of that stuff and uh, yeah, we will see you next week.